Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, Rad here from Radko Tarot and this is going to be Aquarius Sun, Aquarius Moon and Aquarius Rising weekly tarot reading for July 23rd to July 29th, 2018 so without further ado let's go to Aquarius um, reading which is four cards spread now the first card that shows up the topic of Aquarius this week this is going to be the five of cups and then we do have the nine of wands as a core of their situation here Afterwards, that will be the full card, which is uh, the challenges that Aquarius needs to overcome. And the last one, we do have the Queen of Wands. So what happens here, Aquarius, during that particular week is that, um, well, uh, all in all, sh long story short here, guys, things are not going to exactly develop the way you have planned, in a sense of that... Um, Let's say a, a certain execution you thought that is going to happen during that particular week or a certain event that is going to take place or a project for example, uh, activity into relationship etc etc may not happen into that week but could be postponed into let's say um, the next week or the week afterwards etc etc the bottom line here guys is is that um, the five of cups points of the situation will not play out exactly the way you have calculated however it's not going to be entirely ruined so uh, let me give you just an, an example uh, here for your relationship uh, let's say that you have planned to go I don't know on a cinema this week with your partner but suddenly uh, something happens okay uh, with your partner let's say that they are called at work um, to uh, be I don't know uh, sent somewhere on um, uh, you know, um, outside of town, for example, which their work demands, and the tickets that you have bought, uh, that you have bought um, recently, um, are no longer in use. You know, for the cinema, something like this. You know, so that week you should not kind of like count way too much um, on the things you have planned, in the sense of that they may drop off the table due to a circumstances that you don't have any control upon whatsoever, because these circumstances. Are are very global you know they are for the for the greater good rather than for um, the goodness of the uh, of the moment here it is what I'm trying to say so the core of the uh, the core of the situation guys with the nine of wands shows that you need to show understanding toward those kind of events all right or toward those kind of uh, circumstances and as well uh, through that understanding the nine of wands is also about um, uh, patience and it is about in your case filling the gaps so if one thing it's uh, it's not possible to happen when you have planned it definitely when you do have that card uh, definitely you have a chance to fill the gap with something else that is going to be as well very amusing and quite joyful and this is where the fool comes in play here the challenge what could be filled exactly there because you know when someone is really expecting something to happen with um, uh, uh, with great impatience in a sense of that you really want that thing to happen and suddenly you realize that uh, you know it's not going to happen exactly in that particular time one feel despondence one or uh, despondent one feel low in spirit etc etc and one doesn't have any wishes you know to, to do anything uh, into that particular uh, frame of time but the fool here uh, in a challenging position urges you you know to find a replacement so if you cannot go on a cinema with your boyfriend or a girlfriend well take a friend for example or just you know spend the spend the night with um, with the friends of yours in the pub or just watch movies at home etc etc these kind of stuff that you can you know feel the gap of what you have planned that did not work out during that particular week now the five of cups points as well that the uh, that the loss is not going to be that severe that being said you can easily go along without it you know without what you have planned although <clears throat> Uh, this card also points that you may have that sense of lost um, kind of stuck within you when that thing is actually revealed that cannot happen either into your career or either into your relationship so a uh, bottom line here guys is that this week it will be all about your adaptivity and your playfulness rather than um, about your uh, consistency and um, 
you know about your tenacity to necessarily have it your way and at the end we do have the the queen of cups which is the guidance you should follow and as i said the queen of cups as a guidance is about having the knack of how you lead life so in general you need to uh you know find joy in life in all of its gazes all right in in, in many forms that being said you should take advantage of the versatilities uh the modern age gives you to enjoy your time among the sun and among the moon if you want to say it that way you know so basically be uh be creative with how you can um you know with, with with how you can entertain yourself uh without actually depending on other people and upon circumstances that may or may not happen so that being said aquarius this was your weekly tarot reading for july 23rd to july 27 2008 uh, 29th excuse me 2018 i hope you enjoyed it and you liked it and in case you are interested in a private reading with me everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video rat signing out out now see you next time Bye.